hello everyone welcome back to the next video in this video i will show you how to do motion tracking with a robot body uh, in native ios application uh, using uh, augmented reality with reality kit so let's get started so firstly i'll show you the uh, uh, output so so here you can see i have my app running i have already given the cam camera permission and if i uh, like move a little here you can see the 3d robot which is playing now it is a little bit uh, not uh, correct but i think uh, here you can see it has improved a little and if i move my leg it also tries to move its leg so yeah that's what uh, this uh, video is all about so let's get started on how to do this uh, firstly uh, you will need to download that 3d robot and for that you can go to this particular documentation and download it uh, i have already downloaded it and dragged and drop inside my uh, native ios application as you can see over here uh, so here is the robot i'm not sure if you guys can see it so here it is uh, so i have just uh, downloaded it from the documentation ignore this watering can i am not really using it uh, then uh, inside uh, info.plist i have just uh, so go over here info.plist and i think so you have to add this camera usage description permission once you add that go to your view controller here i have imported reality kit er kit as well as combine then here i have created this er session delegate as well uh, here i have creating our er view uh, then we just do this body tracking entity now the entire thing which i will show you even i don't really understand it i have just copy pasted it from the documentation so i have created this anchor entity i have added our er view to our parent view i am setting the frame for our er view i have set the session delegate as well and here firstly we are checking if this is supported on your device or not if no then you will get an error otherwise we are adding our character anchor to our ar view so uh, if i just show it to you this is the character anchor and here we are just using making use of combine so given that uh, the name is robot so i'm that that's why i'm using the same over here uh, and make sure if you are using some different name make sure you change it over here as well and once it is uh, mapped we will come over here we change just the scale change it to whatever you feel like and assign it then uh, this gets called automatically because we are extending ar session delegate and we just get the body anchor uh, then according to our position we just mapped uh, the robots uh, position as well so that's what it is um, even i don't have much idea about this so yeah that's it that's how you can uh, you know do motion tracking with a robot body in native ios application thank you for watching bye